Okay guys, it's pretty late, but just wanted to give you some updates. This is a 1991 Mercedes 420 SEL that I just received. Uh, it's pretty amazing. Uh, I mean, I was doing a lot of uh, work for that older gentleman, so he rewarded me with this amazing 1991 420 SEL W126. This car is not perfect. It's got over 300,000 miles. And, uh, you know, I really love this car so much, and this car is obviously getting saved and all that. Uh, but the uh, first project on this thing is, as you can see, the uh, blue tarp that's trying to fly off. But um, the car was covered like this because these four windows were stuck down, and I just diagnosed the windows. So the windows are... Um, back up and it was actually a power issue it was just one of the fuses got corroded it wasn't making contact you know obviously i i printed out the wiring diagram and all that stuff but i didn't i didn't need to go too far it was just a power issue and then the power seats were not working and uh steering wheel wasn't moving and then that's how i figured out it was probably just a power issue so yeah sure enough right now everything works i'm about to show it to you uh and i checked the battery i actually need to pull the battery out uh and uh, bring it to the store to get it charged because it's about it's got like 10.8 volts right now so the windows uh, are operating slowly and all that stuff um another thing uh that's wrong with it is on this door uh this window is actually not good uh so i can actually push it up and down so the regulator uh slide uh, probably broke off uh it's not a big deal uh but yeah i'll have to take all of that um take, uh, get it all taken care of later but either way i mean all these door uh all these uh, door panels will have to come off and everything needs to be lubricated and all that stuff but here's an ama amazing engine i heard it running before and uh i'm not gonna try to start it right now um the car needs uh, an oil change pretty bad it hasn't had a, an oil change for quite a while um so i'll have to get that done the oil is a little like pretty dirty actually so but it's an amazing engine and uh, you, you know I'll have to do a lot of maintenance to it because it wasn't starting that well it started eventually but it was shaking pretty badly and misfiring or whatever else is going on I don't know so I'll have to diagnose that but here it is guys you know and uh, yeah needs needs uh, to be washed and um, these appear to be chrome wheels but it's like all peeling and stuff like that and I haven't taken this car for a test drive and first I need to take care of this battery and take care of a lot of other small things and lubricate a bunch of things before I take it on the test drive and I need to figure out this engine misfire problem um, and just do an oil change and all that stuff so uh, she's gonna get there eventually anyways let me go inside and show you how the windows operate and everything so this fuse number 17 is the problem it's not uh, sending power to all the relays and all that stuff and if you can see it's kind of weird looking too the terminal on it is like bro breaking off or whatever but so if I move it around it's gonna make contact but either way uh, I'm gonna replace it uh, but as of right now I'm gonna fix it up and show you how the windows operate okay so we're sitting inside of this amazing car uh, 318,000 miles. Uh, okay, it needs a bunch of cleanup. It's pretty dirty and all that stuff. Uh, it needs to be vacuumed, but I'm gonna turn this uh, ignition on if I can find the key. Okay, and then we're gonna try to operate the power windows. Okay, so it's uh, there's the power window going down. Let's go back up. Like I said, the battery, uh, ooh, it's barely moving. Come on, baby. She needs to be lubricated. Wow, that thing is really slow. I have to figure it out. It's gonna go, it's gonna go. Ooh, that's definitely bad. Okay, so that's good. So yeah, like I said, the battery's kind of low and then it needs to be lubricated too. And you know, this, this car needs a lot of maintenance, like all of them do, and, you know, sadly, uh, that's, this is what neglect does 
to these cars. I'm still amazing because these cars still go no matter how you abuse them and stuff. I mean, I'm not that kind of person, but it, it's it's crazy, you know. It's kind of sad, so I'll be giving this car all its love, and yeah. I'm just glad that I found you, you know, someone yeah. that liked these cars. Yeah, I do love this car. Because it's, it is a nice car still, it can be. Yeah. Again. I need to bring it back to life. Right, it can be. It's just that I wasn't... Yeah. Uh, I didn't have that in my plans. Right. Yeah, see, there's the pop ups there. Mm -hmm. And if you don't want that, there's this button here. Cool down the starter a little bit. Let me try again. My battery jumper is getting a little weak too. Come on, baby. You're in good hands now. You'll be good. Yeah. Be nice. Yeah. Ah, oh, beautiful machine. Need to save this baby. This is not good. So, so I started taking care of the interior. Uh, it needs a lot of cleanup and everything. Uh, everything is dirty here and uh, I think there was some, uh, you know, there's actually some mold in here. And this sunroof is actually broken. So I'll have to take care of the sunroof. I tried to actually uh, put grease in there because I didn't have the tape at the time. Put grease in there so that nothing, you know, the water doesn't go through. But the sunroof is actually broken, which sucks. But I need to pull these carpets up and check for moisture underneath. Because this car has been sitting with the windows down for a little bit before uh, the owner actually, um, you know, put the tarp on. So. All right, guys, so I do have a battery for it. Um, and right here, this tray is, I think it's gone, guys. I'm gonna pull it out, try to save it, but I think it's too late. I don't know, I might be able to still save it. So, mm, uh, yeah, I need to take it out and make sure that there's not, no rust underneath and clean the water drain on there before I put the battery here okay it's pretty bad but it seems like it's still savable so i'm gonna clean it really well and we'll see what's gonna happen so i'm hoping that i can save it up you know all right yeah it's pretty bad okay so we're gonna make it look good and uh reinstall it tomorrow most likely Thank you.